Yes. This afternoon, a Colorado mountain town will make a decision on whether or not to allow horse-drawn carriages in their downtown area. This topic has animal advocates and community members speaking up and getting involved. And now it's Connor Wist up in the newsroom where she's been looking into this. And some cities have actually banned these carriages, Connor. That's right, Teresa. Breckenridge got rid of their horse-drawn carriage last August. After having them for a while, the town grew and got busier with more people in traffic, so that decision was not was made to not renew the contract. I asked the assistant town manager if the choice had anything to do with safety concerns for the horses and carriages, and she said that was not the case. But safety is something on people's minds on both sides of this conversation. For Christy Fontaine and her horses, they get to live the country and the city life too. Mr. B. We run in downtown Denver on Saturday evenings. Christy runs royalty carriages, giving horse-drawn carriage rides to people in downtown Denver. We just use single horses because we're on flat, but in the mountains, yeah, it would be nice to have a team. Today, the mountain town of Telluride is making a decision on whether to let the carriages in or keep them out. PETA is urging the mayor and town council members to reject the proposal, citing cruelty and public safety. They're also concerned about horses getting spooked or getting into accidents. Come here. But Christy says she really hasn't had any problems. No takeoffs, no anything that I felt was very detrimental. In Denver, there are specific rules in place for horse-drawn carriages to be used safely. Operators have to be licensed and Denver police permits them to drive on city streets. Christy says the most important factors are being able to read her horses and paying attention to what's going on around the carriage. The horses will definitely tell you if they're not sure of something because their heads will kind of come up and their ears will go forward. Restrictions on times they are allowed to operate also helps her avoid problems with traffic. In the last hour, I heard from people at the Telluride Town Council meeting today. They told me the ordinance passed to allow those horse-drawn carriages within the town, but it's not a done deal yet. There will still be an application process and approval by the town manager before those rides can start. I'm Connor Wist for the Now Denver. All right, Connor. Beautiful horses, though. Thanks so much.